We are at a point where it is very difficult to sustain all of the excellence that we have been able to sustain over a, a long period of time. Um, they're trying to find ways to save costs in terms of administration. So, um, like Kendall was saying, advising things like that that could be sent to LNS. Um, that's student services that are directly being cut. More students for fewer staff, more students for fewer faculty. Um, but it's also really important to stress that no decisions have been made by the campus yet. It's really ironic, I feel like, that they're cutting these programs that are directly affecting students. Students who in many cases have come here for the College of Chemistry in this case, or for the public health major, without having any really input from students. And it was truly inspiring to see you know, I don't even know, dozens if not a hundred or so students out here in the rain. It shows that really students need to be together on this. Um, they're going to be coming for more programs without a doubt. Every single department, every single part of campus is going to be looked at really critically. And we need to make sure that we're not divided and that we're standing up for students and making sure that our education is protected. And get the state, get the federal agencies to support us in our quest for our education. Thank you so much. Fund education, not incarceration. Fund education.